So here we have the Ego 42 centimeter battery power mower. So this is the smallest one in the range. Um, let's open it and see what's in there. Oh, nice and light. Okay, so this is really what well, was really long grass. Um, that's on its lowest setting. I think that's pretty high. But I think that grass is pretty long. You know, it's, 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 it is very stalky and it is horrible, and the lawn is going to be replaced in the next. <sighs> six months or so so that's why I've kind of not bothered with it but I think for a back garden that's too long so now we're looking at the mower on just a rough bit of verge I suppose it is outside a client's house um, very rough bit of grass it's actually as you can see in the road there it's been raining and it's wet and um, it seems to actually be cutting the grass quite well I'm not bagging at this stage, it's just a, it's just, as I say, a rough bit of grass, so um, I can't really test the, the bagging capabilities, but it does seem to be actually cutting it down pretty well, and here you can see just doing some real sort of like dried leaves, mainly from a laurel hedge, and actually it does pick it up pretty well. Obviously with this mower you get all the battery advantages of it being quiet you'll notice i've got ear defenders on that's mainly to listen to podcasts as opposed to the noise and um, at this stage with wet grass and collecting leaves i am pretty impressed with it now of course because it's battery the big advantage is that you can pick it up it's light you can carry it downstairs now, I don't really have too many lawns where, an, where a mower this size is really applicable. So this is about the only one I'm afraid I can show you. Um, I would normally use a Hater 41 on this lawn. Um, so that's kind of what I'm comparing it against. So this lawn's about just under 300 square meters. And what you can see is I'm mowing it without the bag on, sorry, without the roller on. And it's leaving a pretty decent stripe. And again, it is picking up the leaves very well. Now, this is the day after we had quite a bit of rain. And you can see that it's, it's not bunged up in there. It's all evenly distributed. So, so with this, I'm, I'm pretty happy. And that's a pretty decent stripe for for no roller on and you can see now that the bag's full that's a decent sized bag of wettish grass and that was a newly charged 4.0 battery and um, it was only one light's gone out and of course you can carry it back up the stairs too So since watching Mike Day's video on the roller, um, last week I put the roller on and it's a little bit awkward to use. When you lift the mower, you can imagine, when you lift the mower it hangs down and it, it sort of dangles about so it's, um, it's not ideal. But actually, um, I won't tell you what Mike says, you'll have to go and watch the video yourself. Having seen this video, I've taken it off. It actually works as a, as a as a nice counterbalance for when you're carrying the mower. And of course, the reason I'm having to carry the mower is uh, is these steps down here to the lawn. I should tell you that Ego have lent me this mower purely for a review video. I do have to give it back, and 
I'll be honest, I found this mower a little bit frustrating. You can see that it clearly picks up the leaves. You've seen it cut long wet grass. And with the rolling kit, it leaves a decent stripe. Bear in mind that this lawn is now very dry as we go into a record breaking hot summer. And even though I think there could be some lower settings and the quality of cut you'll see in a minute is again not quite what I would want. I do find myself thinking I've got room for this mower and if you asked me was I going to buy one I think the answer is yes I would and that's down to the fact that it has a rolling kit and I'm not aware of any other battery mowers that come with that kit. I do however hope to make a second video reviewing it once there's autumn leaves and there's some serious moisture back in the lawn. So all cut, so this is a fortnightly lawn. They have a dog, as you can see by the burn patches. Um, it's very dry. So I've cut the lawn on its lowest setting with the, the striping kit on. Um, I mean, there's a lot of areas. Where it just, this is on its lowest setting. I just don't think it's enough. It still looks a bit scruffy. I'd almost say it's quite a good rough mower. I've got no issues with that on the on the verges and stuff. So, so this is this is pretty much everything. But all the leaves from the hedge, that's all mulched in there. And of course the rollers on. So uh, I'm not going to show you how to do it because, as I say, you can go over to Mike's channel and watch that. Not sealing his views, but I will, uh, I will show you how quickly you can take the roller off. Just, you can take the roller off and you can take, put the roller on in seconds. Um, it didn't fall off once when I was using it. Um, it was a great tip. And I'm really grateful and as I say actually um, you can just rest the roller on top but uh, but going up the steps I just carry it in the other hand and actually it counterbalances the weight of the mower so it's actually a little bit better like that.